The Wonderful Dogen has just put out on YouTube a video entailing why it is that your voice changes when you speak a different language. Now, there is something in Japanese called pitch accent, and that does change depending on what dialect of Japanese you're speaking. But the phenomenon of your voice changing in tone when you change language is actually something that's very well documented. So, for example, my tone in speaking in my natural neutral North American accent is actually quite low. Mais quand je parle français, mon accent est plus nasal et musical. These are often just functions of the language that you're switching to. However, this is also very well documented in different accents in English. So, for example, if I was speaking to somebody who spoke Californian English, they go up a bit at the end like that. Or you're speaking to somebody in Belfast. Or if you're speaking to somebody in Glasgow. Or if I have switched my narrative voice and I'm speaking to somebody in estuary English like that, my voice is immediately different. This just has to do with general functions of the mouth when we're speaking different languages and different accents. Every language and every dialect and every accent has a different pitch, intonation, and inflection. This also has to do with whom the person speaking to. So for example, many people turn up the pitch in their voice when they're talking to children. You have to take in all these things when you're learning a new language and when you're learning a new accent for an acting job. This is also why if you have a particularly good accent in Japanese, you'll hear people say Nihongo Jozu, or even if you practice a tonal language like Thai, which has five different tones. This is also why in certain languages and in certain accents, some people seem to think that others are singing. So for example, many people who live in Northern Norway are often accused of being very musical in their speech because their intonation goes up and down. As well, certain Irish accents, especially in Cork, have a very musical intonation. If you look up cross-linguistic pitch differences, you'll find a lot of fun things. It's also interesting to note that in this era of global language and global linguistics, everybody's accent is going to be different and everybody's pitch is going to be different depending what language they're learning from where they're learning it from. So if you want to learn all about Japanese pitch accent, I highly recommend Dogen's channel. And if you want to learn other things in linguistics, stay right here.